Hey guys, Sebastian here. I want to do a update video from the New York City Knife Show I was attending this weekend and this is some of the things that I scored. I had a great time meeting all the all the friends that I already know from YouTube, USN. Uh, same with the same with the many new people that I met there who actually watch the watch my channel, my my small little channel and they don't have videos and stuff and that was very very great uh, I first what I get hold of is like they give me this dog tag the guys from the steel flame like and those are actually the guys like with the from the USN and steel flame like Paul and Patrick and Derek and stuff like that they, they actually get me in the USN like a year ago so that was the First little thing on Friday, I did look this little Stingray sheet for my mini Sibenza. It was eight bucks, and it's not really, not really something what I usually do, but it's like to protect my mini Sibenza. But it's a kind of looks like a pain. Yes, I usually like to pull out my knife, pop it open one hand, use it, and put it back. But this is a little more complicated, but something what I wanted to try it out. The other thing. I did get the Wicked Edge, I get the basic model and we'll see how is that working out, I didn't try it yet after those two days and working at, at night, working weekends and having guests so pretty much like I did not get a lot of sleep, I feel already a little exhausted and I might get sick but we'll see. The What I really wanted is this Sniper Blade Works, this is the LPC I get it from the dealer and I know that he know what, what, what he said it's a mini LPC I know like, a lot of people selling now they don't even know what they do this is the mini one and you guys can see obviously the difference so the other thing what I ask him is like is it 1095 or 154 cm he told me it's S30V or right after he was claiming it's a mini one I, I don't know what does he know what he's talking about but I would do like to find out but either way I'm happy with it I did win the lottery for the hinderer with the a lot of our guys from YouTube community did one I did hang out with Vance uh, Jeff uh, Gafco hand hands and a lot of other people I um, maybe I don't want to shouldn't maybe mention because I'm gonna miss somebody and then but met a lot of new cool guys and this was the other score the two and a half inch spanto flipper with the digi camo and looks like a it's like a bronze anodized stone wash uh, I went one on the Friday actually my friend won for me and I did give it to one of my good friends for a good good price and this is the thing that I entered and wanted to experience in their knives and really like it we'll see we'll see so far what's gonna happen it's not really my it's not really my my type of a knife this is more me I like aggressive aggressive looks now but it's definitely I appreciate the craftsmanship and for for this one day playing it it grows on me I think the the biggest score was the Salmonero mini bullseye. Uh, this is this this knife is like something where step up my game. The knife's collecting, and I don't even know if I'm ready for it yet. But this is something what I had a chance to score. It was only four of, four of them, and it was like too many, so many people waiting to to get drawn, and I was. My friend was actually lucky who have the hinderer. He actually didn't want it to enter because if you win this knife, you had a chance to buy it for 850. <laughs> so it's a, it's an expensive knife, and I'm like, why not? I want to try it. You can always flip it, and they go much more on the secondary market. I had all my rent money with me, so I don't know how to gonna pay the rent on the end of the month. But who cares for that? We have knives. So I do have this little thing it's beautiful I'm really admire it it's like it's a great little tactical knife it's very little though but it's not just about the knife it's more about the craftsmanship 
So I'm gonna just compare it really quick with the with the Mini Sibenza. Like you guys see, it's pretty small, all about the same size. The craftsmanship on this Salmanero, it's amazing. It is really like for the costume knife, it's awesome. I really I don't know what I'm gonna do with it honestly, I really don't. But for now it's here and I'm happy. So that'll be it for now. I'm gonna do a, probably a separate reviews on each one of these. Not really reviews, more my thoughts. I gotta definitely learn more about the Salmonero and this display steel PDC old her something. He was explaining it to me. So now I gotta do that and in the meantime I am extremely happy I met a lot of cool guys, a lot of nice people from the from the YouTube community, had a great time and I hope you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.